graduating in December with a youth ministry degree. Currently, I am at a church right now doing my internship, and once that's over, we will hopefully have a church to do ministry in. Uh, in college, I was a two-sport athlete. Um, I played basketball and soccer, so I'm a big sports guy. Uh, I love Jesus. Uh, we're very passionate about the youth. Uh, that's what we feel like we're called to do in life, especially me. I feel called to share the same hope and foundation that my minister gave me when I was in sixth grade that, and share that with the youth. Uh, a short story, I guess my short life story is I was born uh, two parents who weren't together. Uh, neither one were Christian. My father was into drugs and alcohol. So I live with my mother and my father. I saw my father on every other weekend. And my mom got remarried to another guy. And when I was in the second grade, my dad passed away from drinking and driving in a car accident. So I was mad and angry for a really long time. And then my new stepdad ended up being abusive to my mother and uh, cheated on her and hit my sister. And it was just a mess. So again, mad. We were very, very poor growing up because of that. My mom only cut hair, so she made about 13000 a year. And I was the oldest of three siblings. So we were very poor at times and wasn't quite sure where money was going to come in or what was going on. So I was angry for a very long time. And then in the sixth grade, my uh, basketball coach happened to be a youth minister, which was kind of annoying at the time because he always asked us to go to church. But it was pretty annoying. But eventually, he kept bothering us so much that me and a couple of guys went, and I haven't left since. Uh, you know, I was baptized later, and then high school came along, and I decided to give my life to Christ. So I've been through a lot in life and seen the ups and downs of life, and we're just excited to... I mean, Whitney are just excited to start doing ministry because I want to share that hope, like I said, with every, every student I can because it is so important to me. And, you know, we're, we came here to interview. We love it so far. And we're just praying that God puts us in the right place. So I don't know what else you want to know about me. Uh, Big Ten all the way. Sorry, SEC fans. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> I, I know we're not as good. But uh, no matter where I am, I'll stay loyal to Purdue. So boiler up. And uh, hopefully we have a good service. God bless. Some things can be forgiven. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, choir. Thank you, Peyton. Thank you, Miss Jane. We really appreciate it. It's very good and just happy to have you back. We really are. And at this time, we're going to dismiss, dismiss the kids. Uh, to their classes.